My name is Ali Danish Bakhtiari, uh, and I was born and raised in Afghanistan. Uh, I'm currently uh, pursuing my master's in civil engineering and engineering mechanics at Columbia University. This is a very uh, popular and well-known saying by Prophet Muhammad, uh, and it says, study and learn knowledge from cradle to grave. Uh, and, and, and the Farsi, the Farsi translation is Zegahwara Tagur Danish Bujui. And actually my name is Danish too. So, um, uh, and Danish means knowledge. So, um, um, all my, my, my family, uh, you know, like I was, when I was, when I was growing up, uh, we were told in the, in the family to just pursue knowledge, whatever, wherever you are, whatever you do, just go and, and study and learn. So uh, that's what, what I do love to learn. Uh, I face lots of uh, warm welcomes. I've, I've, I've also encountered uh, many challenges. Uh, one of them was uh, starting everything from zero. I mean, leaving everything behind at home and started everything from scratch. I have uh, five uh, brothers. So this is my, my dad. It was uh, basically uh, um, now Ruz, the first uh, day of the year and, and, and uh, solar calendar. Being uh, far away from family and um, being scattered um, all around the world in different continents, it's not something easy uh, for me to cope with. And that's my little niece. She was just five days old when we left Afghanistan. A picture of me among um, other uh, cast members of the Kai Runner movie. Uh, but I was one of the child actors of the Kai Runner movie, uh, which was released in 2007. I played the role of uh, uh, Sohrab. Me and the young Amir, uh, we left Afghanistan together in August 2021. And I do have a picture of us on the plane, on the moment that we got on the plane. It's me and him. I'm taking uh, civil engineering and engineering mechanics and this is our main building where we have most of our classes here. It's called MUD. Uh, my short term goal is uh, to join a high tech company uh, and, and work on the field of autonomous vehicles, uh, which is a very hot and cutting edge topic nowadays. And uh, my long term goal is uh, to be part of the uh, rebuilding and uh, development of the infrastructure of Afghanistan. Uh, one of the things that I appreciate about Columbia University is that they offer places for students to have uh, their own religious activities and have their own meditations. And uh, behind me at the Earl Hall, one of the places, uh, my favorite place that I often visit, and it has a prayer room that I go and you know practice my uh, prayers there. And they also serve halal food and Jay Dining Hall. Um, and I loved uh, the food there. One of the most prominent um, traits of Afghan, Afghans and their culture is their hospitality. And uh, I, I believe Afghans are one of the most hospita hospitable people in the world. I'm, I'm here in, in a meeting um, at uh, Afghanistan Student Alliance. ASA was primarily um, founded by three Afghan students. And their main goal was to gather students, both Afghan or non-Afghan, who are interested in Afghan culture and uh, organize um, social events. But after the fall of uh, Afghanistan, their goal was expanded to, you know, advocating for Afghan students who were uh, both internally or externally displaced. They created uh, the mentorship program for Afghan students who wants to apply uh, to Colombia or other universities in the United States. هر لحظه که تسلیمم در کارگه تقدیر آرام تر از آهو بی باکتر از شیرم هر لحظه که می کشم در کار کنم تدبیر رنج از پی رنج آید زنجیر پی زنجیر Always believe in yourself and believe in God and try hard as much as you could. No matter what, how much obstacles and uh, barriers uh, you encounter, sooner or later you're going to achieve your goals.